Hey Monarchs, it's Miss Chavez here, your college and career readiness counselor. And I'm excited to bring you another college visit video. We have Luis Figueroa here from Western New Mexico University. And he has a presentation for you and he's gonna share a YouTube video and all this great info about Western New Mexico University. Um, Luis, welcome. Thank you for being here with us today. Thank you, Ms. Chavez. Thank you for having me. Um, seniors or students, Manza from Manzano High, I just want to say thank you for giving me this opportunity. And I do hope that today I get to share information about Western New Mexico University and uh, just give you another option to choose from for your college experience. Great. And Luis actually earned two degrees from Western and was there on an athletic scholarship for track. So he has a lot of experience with the school and the community. So his email information is up. You can email him, call him, or contact me, and I'll give you his info if you want more information. But for now, let's start with this video you have. Welcome to Western New Mexico University. I'm student government president, Brenda Hernandez. WNMU was founded more than 125 years ago in Silver City, New Mexico, minutes from the Gila National Forest and endless adventures. As New Mexico's only applied liberal arts and sciences university, WNMU offers over 70 areas of study covering every interest. Speaking of interest, with over 130 activities like our historic great race, You'll never be bored at WNMU, trust me. Visit WNMU.edu, shoot us online, and join us on our next great adventure. Go Mustangs. I love that. And I love that you guys are purple, like we are. I guess we're matching today, huh? Yeah. <laughs> awesome. Well, again, once again, thank you very much. Uh, I do hope today the information that we present to you is very helpful for you to learn a little bit more about Western New Mexico University and also what kind of opportunities. I'm gonna share with you some information that you may already know, you may not already know, and just open up your mind to, to Western. So once again, welcome to Western New Mexico University. I'm your admissions recruiter, Luis Figueroa. If you don't already know, Western New Mexico University is situated in Silver City, New Mexico, which is at the foothills of the Gila National Forest. Also, one unique thing about WNMU is that we're the only public applied liberal arts and science university in New Mexico. So that's one very unique fact about us. But it's not just, it's not just that that makes us unique. If you wanna go to the next slide, it's also our mission at WNMU. We're an open access institution, which, which means that when you attend WNMU, we can help you get accepted to the university. We have a strong foundation in the liberal arts, as well as helping students uh, get prepared for the real world. We have different academic programs, which I'll talk about later, but back to our mission and values, we're very much grounded in our values of innovation and creativity, integrity, intellectual curiosity, personal responsibility, service to the university and the community, and student success. Let's go to the next slide. Now, what makes us really unique, aside from our designation and you know, our values, is also the culture at WNMU. Western New Mexico University is a Hispanic serving institution and a founding member of the Hispanic Association of Colleges and Universities, otherwise known as HACU. We're also home to the only competitive university mariachi program in New Mexico, which is the award-winning Mariachi Plata. We also have a very unique museum which holds the world's largest members art party collection in the world. We have our Light Hall Theater where we bring in performances from local, state, and national level. And let's not forget our annual Fiesta Latina, which is an annual event where we bring in artisans from central and southern regions of, of, of the, the continent uh, to bring a rich culture to the, to the university and to the area. Let's go to the next slide. Now, Western New Mexico University offers over 70 different programs to study. We offer everything from A to Z. A couple of programs to distinctly point out is the first is our School of Education, which recently received an A plus for diversity by the National Council on Teacher Quality. And 
our online social work degree was ranked number one in the nation out of 533 accredited programs out there by the bestonlinecolleges.com. We also have a very unique nursing program, which just recently added a master's in nursing and a certificate program in family nurse practitioner. And all of those can be completed completely online. Also, we have a dual enrollment program that is continually expanding and reaching out to all schools in our region. Our dual enrollment program is preparing students in the applied technology workforce to meet the needs of not only our local area, but also the state of New Mexico. So take a look. We offer programs from certificate programs like our certified nursing assistant to associate degrees in, in business, bachelor's degrees and master programs. Whatever you're looking for, we can help you achieve it. Let's go to the next slide. Also, we have a small student to faculty ratio. At 18 to one, you're gonna be guaranteed you'll be working one-on-one -on -one with your instructors. You'll have that mentor in the classroom. You'll also have that opportunity to be involved in scholarly research. Well, you'll have that opportunity to get paid to do summer internships. You'll get paid to do these national research with our professors and with other universities across the nation. Let's not forget that we also have study abroad programs where you can go study at any of the other 50 partnerships that we have with other universities across the world. We have partnerships in Spain, in Brazil. We have partnerships in the Dominican Republic and other parts of the world as well. So if you're looking for an opportunity, not just at a small college, but also that opportunity to go outside of New Mexico, we'll have that opportunity for you. Let's go to the next slide. And of course, we know that you're not just a student, but you're also a real person. And so we offer these student services for individuals who have challenges because we're all going to have challenges. We offer academic support services. Let's go to the next slide. We also have services for students who are facing food insecurities, like our One Stop Food Pantry, where we partnered up with Roadrunner Food Bank. And we also have technology resources. Let's not forget our health services, which is more important now than ever. We have medical care, counseling services, and dental services. You'll have all of this available to you for free as a Mustang. Let's go to the next slide. We also have residence halls. We do require first-time freshmen to live on campus with us. One of the benefits for living on campus with us is that one, you'll get to have your own room. You're not sharing a room, you're not sleeping in a bunk bed, you get to all have your own private room. How amazing is that? We even have residence halls that have your own bathroom in your own room. So if you really like that privacy, you'll have that opportunity here. Also, there's no curfew. Congratulations. At Western New Mexico University, we're gonna treat you like an adult. So that means there's not gonna be anyone to check you in or check you out. You can invite whoever you want, but keep in mind that when you come to college, there are gonna be some responsibilities. Also, when you live on campus, it's statistically shown that students have a higher GPA, stay more involved on campus, and graduate on time. Let's go to the next slide. Now, talking about staying involved on campus, we do have student life activities where we offer over 130 different activities for our students every semester. At the moment, I know it's a little bit difficult with social distancing and certain restrictions, but that hasn't stopped us from being able to provide all of these different opportunities, whether they're through virtual, whether they're through social media or just limited gatherings. We still have activities for you to go and check out and explore campus. Also, we have over 30 different clubs on campus. One club that's particularly unique at WNMU is our Mustang Search and Rescue Team or our Mustang SAR Team. It is recognized by the New Mexico State Police Department. So when you come to Western, you can also get a certification in outdoor search and rescue, and you can go and help out our community or help out anyone that gets lost. Let's go to the next slide. Also, did I mention that when you come to Western, you'll have the opportunity to enjoy some giant marshmallows with us? Let's go to the next slide. And not just the outdoors, but we also have spacing here at WNMU where you can be able to hang out, whether it's gonna be outside in our gardens area, or if it's inside in the Information Technology Resource Center, there's gonna be spaces available for you as a student to be able to hang out or 
focus and get some studying done. Let's go to the next one. Also, let's not forget about mentioning Silver City itself. Silver City is a unique town in that it's equally parts old Western, an arts hub, and a college town. So no matter where you're coming from, there's going to be something here for you. The surrounding, the surrounding area of Silver City is also the Gila National Forest, where you'll have those opportunities to be able to get, get out and explore. So if you're tired of being on campus or you just want to clear your mind or just get some fresh air or just whatever, whatever you need to do to escape, the Gila National Forest is just 15 minutes away. Let's also not forget that we also have some pretty popular destination spots like our City of Rock State Park and the Catwalk National Recreation Area. There's something here for you. Let's go to the next slide. We also have athletics. As Ms. Chavez mentioned at the beginning, I used to be the former captain of the cross country team here at Western New Mexico University, where I went on to make uh, conference appearances, regional appearances, was All-American All -American academically, and other accolades. But maybe cross country is not your sport. That's okay. We have seven different sports. We have men's and women's cross country, football, men's and women's tennis, we have men's and women's basketball, women's volleyball, we have softball, and men's and women's golf. Whatever whatever sport you're looking into, you, you're going to know that when you compete at the NCAA Division II, Lone Star Conference level, you're going to be competing at the elite level while also being able to balance out your academic life. Let's go to the next slide. Now, Western New Mexico University is one of the most affordable colleges in our region, but we understand and we know that it can still be expensive for a lot of students. That's why we offer over 100 different scholarship opportunities for students ranging from merit-based scholarships, which includes your GPA and your ACT requirements, to financial aid like grants, loans, and work-study opportunities. We also have athletic scholarships and student leadership opportunities. But do not worry. If you're one of those students that doesn't have a high GPA, or maybe you're just, you don't qualify for some of these federal financial aid opportunities, we still have other scholarships. So when you come to Western, you're guaranteed that we're going to be helping you to find ways to pay for college. Let's go to the next slide. To begin your adventure at Western New Mexico University, the steps are very simple. Your very first leap is going to be to apply to Western New Mexico University. One thing, like I mentioned at the very beginning, is that we're an open enrollment institution, which means we don't have a minimum GPA or ACT score requirements for admission. In fact, when you apply to WNMU and you complete your FAFSA application, you're going to be able to meet with an advisor right away to help you move forward with uh, the other steps as well. So when you attend WNMU, just know that we're going to guide you through that process. Let's go to the next step. Some important deadlines for you to know is our admissions and FAFSA applications. We do have a priority deadline on December 1st. So if you're looking to be considered one of the first ones on the list for scholarships, you got to apply before December 1st. That's our priority deadline. Our final deadlines di vary by different categories. In admissions, our final application deadline is August 11th. So that gives you some time. Our financial aid or our FAFSA application final deadline is March 1st. But just keep in mind that the earlier you do it, the better chances you have of being able to be, to be qualified for scholarships. And our foundation scholarships, which offers over 100 different scholarships in different categories, whether you're a first-time freshman or you're going into a specific field, there's going to be scholarships for you. That one has a final deadline of January 31st. So over the holidays, I want you to consider talking about colleges with your family and also look at these deadlines that you have time for to apply and meet those deadline requirements. Let's go to the last slide. Now, I want to let you guys know that, again, I'm a former uh, athlete here at WNMU, but I'm also a former graduate. I got my bachelor's in social work here and I got my master's in educational leadership here at Western New Mexico University. So. I can tell you from experience, you're going to have an opportunity. You're going to be at a place where you're going to be able to fit in. Once again, I'm your admissions recruiter, Luis Figueroa. Go Mustangs. Wow, thank you. That was an awesome presentation. 
definitely, um, I took some notes and um, I learned a lot. I, I actually really did learn a lot about Western New Mexico University. Um, I've been a college career counselor for about seven years now. And, um, you know, we, we get a lot of the local school attention and the big university attention. But this school, I mean, one of the things that sticks out to me is the nursing program. Because over the years, how many times have I had a friend or a student tell me, I'm on the wait list, I can't get into the nursing program. And this is like another option, another opportunity to get those dreams accomplished. Um, the small school environment, college town of Silver City is just beautiful. Um, that forest looks amazing. Hot, hot springs I saw on one of the slides. <laughs> so, I mean, it just kind of has like that NAU environment feel or Durango, um, which I find very appealing and peaceful. The athletics are there. Um, one thing that sets you guys apart is definitely the living arrangements for your freshmen. They get their own room, which is like almost unheard of in a lot of these big universities. So uh, huge selling point. Yes, our, our students really love that. Um, and it was something that was requested a while ago. We used to have the traditional um, boys dorm and girls dorm, um, but we've gotten away from that model. And so now we have um, co-ed and not necessarily that guys and girls are living in the same unit, but they do live in the same hallway. So you have a unit of all girls, next door neighbors could be a unit of all guys. Um, and of course, our campus is also very safe. That's something that I didn't mention, mention at the beginning. We have um, security cameras all over campus. We have campus police right on campus as well. And of course, we have the emergency um, call buttons as well. So when a student comes to Western New Mexico University and lives on campus, they're gonna, they're gonna know that they're gonna be in a safe university. Wow. Nice security systems. Um, yeah, and activities to feel included, a lot of student support opportunities. Dental, I mean, that's almost unheard of too. Getting like those kind of services um, really seems like a place where a student can go and be taken care of. You know? Definitely. Definitely. We, like I, like I said, uh, we, we really try to promote student success and we approach it in the way that it's not about, it's not success in the terms of getting your degree, but it's what does success mean for a student? Mm -hmm. You know, whether that is being able to get health services or they're, you know, just they're a 2.0 student out of high school and they're just looking to you know, start off fresh at a college, you know, whatever their definition of success is, we meet them where they're at and we help them graduate at the top of their class. Mm -hmm. I really get that impression. And I think that's important for our students also. And I like the culture of the school. And um, I, I do think for our English language learner students or students that, you know, are new to the country, that is a very welcoming environment to, again, Maybe their English isn't because they moved to our country later um, to kind of build upon that and grow. Um, so quick questions I have. So you said no ACT, SAT score required. No GPA requirement. That's right. We we don't have those minimum score requirements, although we do um, highly recommend that students graduate with a minimum 2.0 GPA in order to be uh, successful at the university level coursework. Mm -hmm. um, of course, you know, student that comes underneath that, you know, we have a lot of support services for them, whether it's through tutoring in our Center for Student Success or individual one on one time with our faculty. Um, you know, we'll take a student where they're at and we'll help them move up and improve so mm -hmm. it's it's um it's not a problem for us and i i love that because a lot of the times you know um you know me for example i started college and was behind where my peers were and it, you know you almost have to work twice as hard to keep up and sometimes that's where students fall through the cracks and so this is a safe nurturing environment which which sounds great um the cost you had um between 15 to 18 credit hours 
$36.98, so almost, you know, $36,000. Is that per semester or per year? So that is per semester. Mm -hmm. And like I mentioned, we have um, over 100 different scholarships that helps meet that need right there. Uh, we have a lot of students for a first generation. And so, you know, for them, it can be a challenge. You know, I, I, I me talking from personal experience as a first generation, I know how difficult it can be to navigate through finding ways to pay for college, especially if you don't have like a savings account or, you know, your parents working full time and you don't, you just like, I don't, I don't even know how to apply for scholarships. Um, you know, that's one of the things that, 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 I'm very good at because I've been there. So I try to help out students as much as I can in finding res uh, scholarship resources. Awesome. Well, I think we're gonna try and have you back to do either an application workshop or maybe help these students apply for this foundation scholarships before January 31st. So we'll definitely be having you back to our school sometime this year soon. I would appreciate that. Yeah, let me invite me again. Let me know what I can do to help out um, students. Again, I'm here for you. I'm here to assist you with any questions you have. Anything as simple as, you know, what is our mascot to, um, you know, how to get started at Western. I'll be here to help you out. And, and like we had up there on the banner before, seniors get your transcripts sent directly to Western New Mexico University through parchment. That'll be the fastest way to get qualified for those merit scholarships apply um the link to apply is on the website for western new mexico university and just email myself or luis if you have any questions thank right, you very we, much we look forward to having you back to our school thank you for being here today thank you take care everybody All right. bye